People who can speak multiple languages. What language do you think in? Submitted by should be your slave. I'm fluent in English. Vietnamese is my mother tongue. Speak a little French. I mainly think in English since I moved to US but my dreams come in Vietnamese still. French when I speak French. English when I speak English. Sometimes English when I speak French. I'm French though. That's weird. It's interesting to see so many people with English as their second or third language and they only think in English. Interesting stuff. I am fluent in both Spanish and English but I only think in English lol. My first language, Romanian. Second, German. Third, English. My brain. Fuck your mother language let's go with English. I can think in them all. When I'm speaking a language, I think in that language even if I'm not 100% fluent. When I'm not speaking, I generally think in one of two languages I'm a native speaker in. I don't consciously control it. Sometimes I'm surrounded by one language and my brain randomly starts thinking in the other but usually I'll think in the language I last used. First language. Danish. Second language. English. Third language. German. It switches between Danish and English. Edit. Rip my ing box. My first language is Swedish but I'm fluent in English and pretty much only speak English at home. I can also understand Danish and Norwegian and speak a bit of French. I mostly think and dream in English unless I've been speaking, reading a lot of Swedish or if I'm Doing stuff where my vocabulary is lacking in English. I'm Anglo and my French is fading but when I'm super pissed I swear in Canadian French if only in my head. I forced myself to think in Dutch when I was learning it. It's a good way to speed up learning a language. I started off thinking in English and then translating Spanish into English in my head. It took a lot of effort. The weirdest thing was when I started knowing words in Spanish that I didn't know in English. And then it was weird again when I started understanding Spanish words and sentences without having to consciously translate them into English. First it was like I would hear someone say something in Spanish and the understanding of the whole meaning of the sentence would pop into my head the same way as when someone said something in English. I learned English much much earlier in life, so that's my default. But if I'm hearing Spanish or listening to Spanish music or media, or even sometimes when I'm not, there are a lot of times when I think in Spanish, too. And honestly, I kind of prefer thinking in Spanish, but I'm not quite sure why. Maybe it's that the music is better? While I was in seminary at the Southern Baptist Theological Seminary there was a professor there who was very skilled in languages. For example, he was planning a trip to Turkey to study something, and someone asked him why he was reading a book in German and he said, the best book on some specific part of the Turkish language is written in German. There was a story that might have been urban legend, but one day he was walking across the quad and the school. President stopped him and said, Dr. Gentry, how are things going? Quote, I'm disappointed. Why? Quote, because I know nine languages, but can only think in five of them as year. Asterisk asterisk edited to add. Single quote. School. Asterisk asterisk. I speak Portuguese, English, Spanish, and German. In my house multiple languages were spoken in a mix at all times. Words in sentence weren't exactly from the same language. When I speak with my family like that, I think in no language in particular in its second nature. When just speaking a single language at a time, I typically think in that language. When it comes to counting it's mostly German. My first language is Portuguese and I can speak a little bit of Spanish and I'm fluent in English. I'm not surrounded by people talking in English whatsoever yet I mostly think in English. It makes no sense to me but oh well. I consider myself to be fairly fluent in English. My thoughts partially switched to it when I was around 17 years old. 
I had been speaking a little English since I was three, but I started seriously studying the language only when I turned 16. Currently, my inner monologue is both in English and in my native language. When I'm giving a speech in my head, discussing some concept with myself, I usually think in English. On the other hand, my inner voice uses my native language for the most of the mundane things. Like my exams are tomorrow. Yet here I am, browsing Reddit. Also, on some rare occasions, I hear nothing and just know what I'm thinking about. I live in America now, fluent in English, French, Bosnian, and Dutch. I always think in French. I was born and raised in France. So it's personally what I find more comfortable. Loving this thread because it's sort of blowing my mind. Also, everyone in this thread chose to think in English to comment, edit, grammar. A combination of all the languages I speak, though the one I am predominantly using at that point in my life takes precedence. For example, a thought I had earlier was, what have I forgotten? Je du faire quoi que Je du French. I had to faire quoi Italian. Do something. Or, quote, penso che ho, laissez la clé, key, dot quote, which is a horrible, Italian, dash, French, hybrid that sums up my thinking quite well. Or I might be greeting someone and my first instinct is to sew it French. But I'll have to switch last minute to the language I should be using with themes here it's messy. And annoying but pretty cool. Honestly. I never understood that. I don't think in a particular language. I never did. I think in like. Thoughts. I don't know. The pure concepts just flow into my head and I then translate them into speech. Baby talk. I'm Dutch. But when I was young, six to ten years old, I was online talking English so much that I was getting better in it than Dutch. And I eventually started thinking and taking notes for school in English. Even though my English isn't as good as before, I still always think in English thanks to this. First languages, Greek, German. Second language, English. I can think in all three of them. But if I have been using one of them more than the others, my mind gets stuck to that language for some days. This means that even though Greek is one of my native languages, I will start thinking in English as soon as I am required to use it extensively over a period of four days. In all of themes, you're also in pictures, animations, music. I only speak German and English. I mostly think in German though. My native tongue but when I'm thinking about a concept that doesn't have a word in my native language I think in the language that has. I'm Indian and hence know five languages. The language I think in differs according to situation. If I'm thinking about my family related matters, I think in my own mother tongue. When I'm thinking about friends, it's in the language we converse the most, i.e. Hindi. Thinking about work life is always in English. Rest of the two languages I don't think in much. It's strange how I hadn't noticed this pattern until I thought about it now. I think about memes in English to courtesy Reddit. P. My native language is Spanish. I currently live in USA. I think in English. I think we usually think in the language we are surrounded by if we are fluent. Hi everyone. I'm from Kazakhstan and I know Kazakh and Russian language for 100%. English, intermediate, and can read in French. We learn at school. Korean, I interested in. And Turkish, I'm introvert. So I felt comfortable when others don't understand what I'm saying. So I can say what I really think of this person without hitting him as here to improve English. I try to think in English. Sometimes it turns out that I forget the words in my native language or Russian. And replace the words with English words. I know that three languages are not so much. But I hope it was interesting for you. I fluently speak three languages and currently I am learning a fourth one. 
The only time I need to think in a language is when I have to write. Normally I don't process my thoughts like series of words or phrases, but by mere concepts and sometimes images. If F I read or hear the world, Apple, written in English, I don't need to translate it to my mother tongue. The image of an apple just pops up in my mind. Same goes for abstract concepts somehow. I speak English, Swedish, French and Spanish. I'm born in the US but spent most of my childhood. 7 to 18. Abroad. Yet I still doggedly think in English. Weirdly. I sometimes dream in French but never in Spanish or Swedish. In order of learning 1 English, 2 Spanish, 3 Japanese, 4 Chinese, Mandarin. Also some Russian, German, and ASL. When I know I'm going to be using them I think only in Japanese and Mandarin. I also accidentally interchange words a lot in these two languages even though they are very different. My Russian isn't very good anymore but when I first started learning I loved thinking in Russian. Same with German although I will think in this occasionally. As far as Spanish, I can understand it spoken and written, but can't speak it well. Guess I don't really think in it. I don't really think in ASL either but will sign sometimes. Like for music or something I can't say out loud. Sometimes also when drinking. Looking back, I learned Chinese Mandarin and Japanese mostly through music and TV shows. Because in that way it's easier to see the language applied. I believe it also makes it easier to think in. All of the other languages didn't hold my interest quite the same. Probably because I couldn't enjoy the types of things in those languages that I enjoy in English. I don't think in a language. I think in images and concepts of sentences. Now this is a fucking question. After spending just two weeks in Germany to learn the language, I found myself thinking almost exclusively in German. It was hard because I didn't have vocabulary for a lot of things yet. But when I came across something like that, my brain would think in pictures or in really strange German descriptions before it would even try going to my native English. It really seems to be tied to whatever I spoke last. I can't force myself to think in German now. Unless I say a sentence or two first, then it just clicks and I can't switch it back to English. Unless I do the same thing again. Native in Polish and German. Later learned English to fluency. French halfway in bits and pieces of some Asian languages. Strong emotions are strictly Polish. Kurwa. All the rational thought almost exclusively German. Sometimes English creeps in. Especially at work. Where it's the main language. Ooh something I can help with. I'm American. I've always spoken English. My parents both can speak other languages and taught me a bit of Japanese growing up. But for all intents and purposes, I spoke only English, until high school, when I had to take a foreign language. I chose French because I was 14 and thought it might be useful on dates. It wasn't. However, my best friend was in the same class and pressured me to do four years of French with him as sure he was a lot more motivated than I was, even though we both got good grades. Anyway, the summer before our senior year, we have AP French homework. This isn't like a few pages of worksheets though. No, this is like full research projects and essays. One day I wake up and there's two weeks left of summer. And I haven't done any French yet. So I start putting in crazy hours working on French and only French. It's eight hours a day of studying and working. And it's a struggle since I'm not the best student. But a few days before school starts, something different happens. I wake up ready for another exhausting day of French. Only it's not another day. It's asterisk on autre jour. Quel dollar asterisk. I'm thinking in French. I've been working in it so much that my brain's been wired for French now. That kind of changed how I think about things now. I wouldn't consider myself fluent in French. But it's taught me the importance of immersion. Taking a challenging college course. Don't distract yourself with YouTube. Put more time in your studies to get yourself thinking about that more.
It's been super helpful having a way of changing my mindset like that. TLDR. If you've never learned a foreign language, try. It changes the way you think.